offer people a possible solution for when your playlists on your Mac, iTunes, are not syncing with the iPhone playlist. I recently began using the Apple iCloud Music Library, and after I turned on the feature on all my devices, I actually plugged my phone into my computer and synced it, and the playlists that I have down here were not showing up over here, and I found a solution to it. Now, as you can see, I was able to transfer the new music playlist the exact same songs onto my phone and I was also able to do it with YouTube and I'm going to show you how I was able to fix it with this playlist right here the anonymous one if I go back to my playlist on my phone that playlist is not here and everything's all set up after I show you how to sync this for the people who already have everything set up I'm gonna show you how to get everything set up but I'm gonna go to this first save people time so they don't have to sit through that if they already have everything set up the right way so all you need to do is right here create a new playlist and I'm gonna type in the exact same name now that I have that just be aware that the new one that I made is the second one because of the same name you can name it something different and then change it after but what you want to do is select all these songs drag and drop and as you do that there it is on my iPhone now. Now all I do is go in here and delete the old one. And that's it. I'll show you that everything's working correctly now. I'll go up to my songs and I'm going to select a random song, Sleepless, right here. And we'll put that into Anonymous. And I'll click on this and we'll see it right at the top. I changed the view to have it organized by date so I could find it easily. And if I go into that playlist on my phone now, it's actually at the bottom on this playlist. Right there, sleepless. And I'm going to remove it also. Do command delete. It's gone from that playlist. And at the bottom of this one, it's now gone as well. So everything seems to be working all right. So if that is a possible solution, I'm not saying it's definitely going to work, it might work. Now, if that didn't fix it, you may have an issue with everything being set up properly in the first place. What you want to do to make sure everything is set up properly is go into iTunes Preferences. And you want to go to this right here. And just make sure everything's checked off. Just read through it. I mean, if you copy what I have, it should work because mine's working. That's what you want to do for the iTunes Preferences. You also may want to do this right here. We go down to Library and then update iCloud Music Library. And that will go through a process right up here in the corner. You can see it processing, where it's going to just make sure that everything in the library on iCloud is synced up with the iTunes version on your Mac. And finally, if we go into the settings on my iPhone, go to Music. And again, if you want to copy this. So this is what worked for me, and I hope it works for you. Stay tuned for more videos.